33 on your three easy pays. So about $11 a plant. They are perennial, so they'll come back every single year, bigger and better. But without further ado, let me invite in Roxanne De Palma, who I'm assuming is coming to us from sunny Southern California. I am oh, girlfriend. living the life. Hey, how yes. are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm so good. I'm excited to spend time with you tonight. I know we're going to see Larry as well. So I get, you know, I get, I get both of you for the price I want. It's great. I know you, you get both of us. How about it? How about well, it? Guess what? What? I, I love that we're getting you for all of our garden shows because you are an inspiration to me. You have just really come around and you're really doing a great job of learning the plant world and Thank the gardening you. world and the decorating world. So we're here, Julia, so to create your patio, mm -hmm. your garden, your backyard that you have always deserved. And that's why I had to bring this hummingbird lunch poopia. Well, first the, of all, that the, is the nicest thing you've ever said to me. You said all nice oh. things to me, but you know when we first met at the flower, uh, the flower show in Philadelphia back the in 2020, yep. right before the world shut down, and I knew nothing. And every season that passes, I learn more and more from you, from Larry, from our gardening friends here. So this is really special. Now, we had this before, the Hummingbird Lunch Honey Bells, and they were crazy on fire, so popular. Yeah. Okay. So this plant is over the top. Makes me crazy excited <laughs> because it is a perennial in zones eight to 10. If you are um, in any of those lower zones, you're going to make this into a house plant. Okay. It is a two tone flower. Okay. That's what I love about this. It's got that beautiful pinky red and then it has the yellow on the end of it. This is like me. It is a sun lover. Then once it gets established, Julia, it turns into a drought tolerant plant. Really? Blooms nonstop. Okay, look at that shot. That is literally hundreds and hundreds of feeding ports. Do you know a hummingbird will feed up to a thousand flower on a thousand flowers a day? Really? This plant is electromagnetic to hummingbirds and butterflies. It's perfect for hanging baskets, mm. containers. Oh my gosh, if you have a window basket or a window planter, you are going to go cuckoo crazy over this. This thing is better than a self-cleaning oven, girlfriend, because it deadheads itself and it's deer resistant, which you've learned you've learned about those pesky <laughs> yes, little deer, haven't you? I have. Oh my gosh, they run rampant out here on the East Coast. Back on the West Coast, it was like a magical moment if you ever spotted a deer in the wild. Right. Here they are oh, everywhere and they wreak havoc on our gardens. Yeah, well, these are also not only deer resistant, they're also pest and disease resistant. Really? So you're not going to get those icky little aphids on them either. This plant is a total game changer for whether it's your house, a condo, an apartment, mm -hmm. a patio. I mean, you can have a beautiful pollinator plant easily. Well, They're I have fast acting. a quick update because these were new just a matter of a few weeks ago. Right. We have sold 1,350. That is more oh than half of our quantities that we've brought in. So these are going quickly. Remember, garden season will be coming to a close soon before we know it. This is your opportunity to pick up more than one, attract those stunning hummingbirds that just feel like you're being kissed by a touch of magic. Now, this is how they come to you. Three different pl or three plants. They are live. They are in two and a half inch pots. So what do I do when these come home to me, Roxanne? And guess what? You're going to get them out of those pots. Okay. Actually, let them sit for a day. Water okay. them, okay? In the pots. And then you're going to get them out of those pots, and you're going to put it into at least a 12-inch pot, okay. okay? Or if you're going to use it as a border, take and space them about 18 inches apart, okay. all right? They make fabulous borders as well. We went to Pebble Beach. I think I told you this story. And we were walking along um, right at Pebble Beach at the golf course, and both my son um, and my daughter, Anna and Matt, were like, Mom, Mom, look, there's Kufia. And sure enough, it was Kufia year round up at Pebble Beach. Mm. And this is what 
they love. Do you see these little tubular flowers here? That is what those sweet little babies take and eat off her. And, and Cornell University has said in many studies now that this particular hummingbird lunch poofia is now the highest content nectar flower out there. Wow. That's a lot. Whoa. But think, I know, it's huge. I mean, Julia, look at that one plant that you have in front of you that's yes. blooming. There's hundreds and hundreds of blooms on that yeah. plant. That plant is not that old. Isn't that gorgeous? I mean, it's I got that beautiful you know, emerald green. What I was commenting on last time we presented this together, how Mother Nature really got it right with this plant. Because yeah. each little tubular feeding port or flower in that gorgeous magenta pink that you see, it is just shaped for a hummingbird's beak. So it really just attracts them and they can really get right to that nectar. 1,400 yeah. now ordered this season. Oh we my have gosh. 1,250 remaining and that is it. I really recommend you pick up more than one because they're just going to bring so much joy to your garden. It's a sale price of $33.98, $11.33 on your three easy pays. It's M89185. Oh, hey, little guys. <laughs> I love these so much. Thanks.